Hello guys, I'm back with another build. This build is for Cody 18 and um it's based on the repair skin. Let me give you a real little rundown on it. Here you have your videos. You have your movies. It's pulling from your library. On the top left, that's pulling from the movie database. This is what's in the cinemas right now. And on the bottom left is upcoming movies. And click on it. And here you have all your information, your trailer. All right. And on the left, this is from the movie library, recently added. Only have four movies in there. And I use um, either Specto or Zen add-ons to um, add the movies to the library. All right, so here we have the TV shows. As we go up, only have two TV shows in the library. Actually, I have 10, but two of them is unwatched. All right. Here we have our add-ons. You have your video add-ons, your music add-ons, picture add-ons. And here you would find your add-on browser for you to install your zip file or install from your own repository. Now as we scroll to the left, we have your picture, your pictures. This is the Zen add-on, it's called Big Box. And it's pulling from Zen New TV Shows and Zen New Movies. Here we have Films HD. It's from the Exodus add-on. It's pulling from popular TV shows and popular movies. My Cave is pulling from Specto Popular Movies and Specto Popular TV Shows. For music, we have the Karma add-on and the TuneIn Radio Music. Now Stream is from Vivo. And you have your YouTube add-on. Sanctuaries from Bob add-on. It's the kids section. And the box sets for Bob. Now we have cinema that the Zem add-on. English HD movies and English movies. All right, now let's go into the system, but before that, I'll show you when you go to the sub menu. Excuse me, general, that's where you would find your um your file manager in the sub menu. So you can add just your sources. All right, let's go into system. Now I'm going to show you if you want to add your own add-on on the main menu bar. You go to skin, slide to the right, and go down to configure skin. Go down one time to home. And you would start off with add more categories. As you can see, cat 1, 2, 3, 4 is filled up for me. All right, let me. All right, let's start fresh. So, item number thirteen. Let's say I want to add a, a add-on to the home menu. I will click that on, slide to the right, and slide this to preset. 
go down one time and choose your path if you want to put a video add on you will highlight that and slide to the right and go down to where it says select add-on and then you select your add-on All right, I'm going to choose Exodus. Now you go down where it says widget. You click on type. And you go down to custom. Now you have two options, select top and select bottom. So you can add two widgets on your um, home screen. You go down to add-on, video add-on. Exodus. I'm gonna select movies. Mm. Go to genre. You can add it to wherever you want it. You just gotta go to use as widget. I'm gonna choose family and use as widget. All right, so we have the top right there. And if you want to add a bottom, you keep going down. It says bottom widget. And you repeat the progress of whatever category or if you want to put TV shows or anything on your um, home menu for the widget. Okay, when you keep scrolling down on the bottom, on the home menu bar, is going to say custom 13. So you would need to... It says no focus. So this is how to know. Let me back up out of this. As you can see on the little display there, you can see the difference from focus and no focus. The focus got a little shadow on the bottom, and the no focus has no shadow. So we're going to do no focus first. You click on that, and you could choose whatever you want from here. I'm a I'm going to choose this one. No focus. That's the wrong one. There's always two of the same kind. One that's focus and one that's not focus. Now we're going to back up out of here. And here we have it. I will just give it a second for the, um, the widget to load up. We'll come back to that. The widget will pop up in, in a minute or two. Or you could restart your Cody. But let me show you how to install the build. And we're going to come back to the, the menu. Hopefully by then it will be loaded up. As you can see these are starting to load up. In order to install this build, you would have the Aries repo. You would want to go to your add-ons. Alright, once you have the Aries repo installed, you'll go into your add-ons and it will be in your program add-ons. Go into the Aries Wizard.
Okay, now once you're in the Aries Wizard, you would slide down to Backup. And once you're in Backup, you would go into Select Backup File. Slide to the right. And then click on that. And you would navigate to wherever you downloaded your file to at. In my case, on the NVIDIA Shield, I'm going to my Downloads folder. Okay, and then hit OK, and then refresh again, click on that. Now you give it a second to check the file, make sure everything is good to um, install. As you can see, it's 251 megabytes. And now all you have to do is click restore and then it'll be installed. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up and subscribe. Okay.